Oh my gosh, you guys, it's Jam Sky. Hey guys, what's up? We are back with episode 2 of our rebooted Pokemon Emerald, which is pretty cool, so I'm hoping to see how far we can get in today's episode. And there's something I want you guys to check out real quick, so check this out. I made myself a BRB screen just in case if I have to be right back. Pretty cool, what do you guys think? That's pretty cool, so just in case if I have to do something, I'll put that up, I'll mute the audio, and then I'll be right back. And then I'll put it back to here and be like, hey guys, what's up, I'm back. So that's pretty cool. If you guys do like that, make sure to thumbs it up. Uh, comment below if you like it. Awesome. So make sure to smash that like button and subscribe if you are new. And let's see how far we can get in today's episode as we are hooked up with a, a Google Cast, Chromecast. So I've got it on my phone here, and we are casting onto our TV. So here we are, back with Pokemon Emerald. And let's see how far we can get in today's episode. So, I went and decided to level up our Mudkip just a little bit. Grant, we won't be using him as much. So he's level 7. We have Ho-Oh. Uh, like I said, we went for uh, Legendaries first, so just to start things off a little bit different as usual. We have our Deoxys, Rayquaza, and Lugia. Um, so what we're going to do is actually switch our Deoxys to the front here. And we are going to, I believe we have to, um, yeah, we have to, so I talked to this dude earlier, um, and we have to fight off, um, the, uh, Team Magma trainer, so I'm going to do some battles here. I'm going to speed up some, just a little bit of battles so we're not taking too long. So I want to see how far we can get in two days episode. Uh, but yeah, if you guys do are enjoying these uh, episodes, make sure to smash that like button. Subscribe if you guys are new. Smash the like button. Um, and if we can get up to like at least maybe 100 or 200 likes, I will do a giveaway for you guys. I promise that. It will be a special giveaway for all of you guys. If we can get at least 200 likes on my future uh, episodes of Rebooted Pokemon Emerald. So make sure to share this to all your friends, Get share these videos out there, uh, get my videos out, because you guys are awesome. Um, and yeah, pretty awesome, you guys are just amazing. I think we're at like 90 something subscribers now, I mean, that's pretty crazy. Pretty crazy ride. You guys are just full of excitement and amazement. Thank you guys so much for subscribing. It's just amazing how far we were able to get with this channel, because I was actually, I didn't even think we'd get this far, but look at us now, that's pretty crazy, you guys are amazing, like I said, so thank you guys so much for subscribing, um, it is official, I do have a, a job now at Big Lots, so I'm part-time right now, which gives me uh, good days to uh, do these videos for you guys, which is amazing, so pretty cool, uh, depending on my schedule, I don't know if it'll change, but so far right now, that's pretty cool. Uh, so we'll go ahead and continue on with some of these battles and battle off the uh, Team Magma so we can um, we can get in here and get back Pico to get to the next island or so. Alright, so we have a Pokeball up here which we'll get and that is our Pokeball so we'll get that. Oh, I thought it was Team Magma, it's Team Aqua. Oh well. It, you're usually against both Team Aqua and Team Magma and Emerald. I'm not sure why. But, I guess we'll find out soon. So we're going to go ahead and battle off this Team Aqua person, which is pretty simple. So, we're going to do that. And we'll just go ahead and continue on. We have the Devon Goods, which is pretty cool. And this guy comes back for his Pico. And yeah, some pretty cool stuff. So we're just going to go ahead and fast forward some of this. I think, yeah, there's an item right over here. Um, yeah, I don't know if I will do a, a, a secret base in uh, an emerald, but I do have a secret base, which is pretty nice. I'll show you guys in uh, Auras. Pretty cool. Um, 
right off of uh, Rusboro City. So pretty cool, pretty cool. I'm gonna go ahead and fight off this trainer, Nincada. You know, what's cool is like if you have an Nincada and you have an open space in your bag, I don't know if much people know about it, but some people have played Pokemon and they know about it, but for the people that don't know about it, as long as you have an open space in your uh, Pokemon bag, if you evolve a Nincada, you'll, you'll get a Ninjask and a Shed Ninja, so that's pretty cool, which is a ghost type Pokemon, so it's pretty interesting. So we'll go ahead and get uh, a letter, is it, I think? Yeah, we'll get the letter to, go, to uh, give to Steven to the next town. So we'll go ahead, and he heals us up, which is nice. So I don't think we have to heal up any. Yeah, because he uh, healed us up for us. Healed us up. Because it's good to uh, have people that heal you up, so you don't always have to go back to the... Um, Pokemon Center. Uh, let's see. New feature for the Pokenav. Uh, Alright. What is this? He added... Oh, the match call. That's right. He added the match call. Okay. So I guess we have to uh, try out the Nav. The uh, match call. Otherwise, we can't move on. So we'll call the, uh, the president of the Devon Corpse. And he sees that we know it works. So that's pretty cool. All right. So now we can go ahead and continue on. So let's go ahead and continue on as we as we go down and we see uh, May, which I'm not quite sure. Oh, the match call. Yeah, she adds us in her. Uh, she she adds us with the match call and such. So oh, and we obviously have to battle her then. So we're obviously gonna win anyway. So not like that's going to matter as much. Uh, so she still has Trico, which I'm not quite sure why her Trico didn't evolve yet, but I guess every Pokemon evolved at different levels, which is okay. So we'll go ahead and beat her off. We win. Alright. Okay, so now we can go ahead and continue with getting to the uh, next place. So we'll go ahead and go back through Petal Petalburg Woods. And go all the way back here. And I'll be able to talk to the, uh, the captain here. Oops, if we can slow this down a bit. There we go. We want to go to... Yeah, Slateport. There we go. I want to go to Slateport City. Yes. Let's go set sail. Alright. So now we're off to the next. Oh, we get a... Uh, match call from our dad, so he's going to eventually add us. Yep, added. Alright, so that's pretty cool. Hopefully we don't get too many match calls. Um, so what we're going to do is heal up just because. And what we're going to do is, we already healed up, so. What we're first going to do is, while we're here, we're going to get the, uh, the old rod, because we can, so why not. Um, we are going to go to the gym, and we're going to battle the gym leader. Um, I believe we can get through this without battling anyone. So, yep, here we are. So we're going to go ahead and save right here, just because we want to battle the gym leader. Because we have strong Pokemon. Level 30s. So we're hopefully going to uh, win if we can. Take out that psychic. There we go. Super effective. So we'll be able to win with uh, psychic, hopefully. There we go. And now we have to take out the uh, Makoita. Alright, super effective. There we go. Now we're at level 31. And we beat Brawly. So now we have two badges. That's right. We have two badges, the Knuckle Badge, up to level 30, so that's great, TM08, alright, and we registered him, Brawly, in our Pokenav, so now we have two badges, hopefully we can get uh, the third badge, if possible, and what's interesting is like all these uh, gems are a tad bit different in Emerald than they are in Ruby and Sapphire, but that's okay. 
because everyone has to be at least a little bit different, right? So, um, what we'll do is, yeah, we can go this way, and then there's a hidden item right here, which is a Pokeball. So we got that, which is pretty cool. And we'll go ahead and not try and battle the fishermen. And we will go ahead, I think the dude gives us a, a, a TM or something. What does this dude give us? Um, yeah, it gives us, a, uh, gives us HMO5, which is Flash. Which we don't really need Flash, because we can already get through this pretty easily. And we have the escape rope, which is nice. We can get out pretty easily as well. Um, so we're just going to try and uh, get through this cave here. Which I believe should be pretty easy, because we don't really need Flash. Some people like say they need flash just to get through, but like a lot of people already know this place, so it's pretty easy to get through. As some people like usually are speedrunners. I'm not much of a speedrunner, but just LPs are kind of fun and entertaining for you guys, and that's why I enjoy making these for your guys' entertainment. Um, but yeah, again, I'm not quite sure if I. We'll do a live stream, I'm not quite sure yet, but if you guys want to see one in the future, make sure to uh, make a comment down below, and I'll go ahead and comment back to you guys if I see enough comments. Um, but yeah, if you guys are enjoying these videos, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe if you are new, and yeah. Alright, so here we are, we're getting close, right in here. And what's interesting is, like, in Auras, it's a lot different than the original games. Because when you walk in here, you actually see Steven and the, the wall, the majestic wall, which is pretty crazy. So, pretty cray-cray. Um, so now we gave the letter to Steven, and he gives us Steel Wing. And then he uh, registers in the Pokenav. He leaves, we leave, and we're able to get to the, uh, oops, the next town, which it is... I don't necessarily remember what the next town was, but you guys know what the next count, next town is. So we'll go ahead and do that. Hopefully we can get to the electric gym and do that. So we're speeding up just a tad bit. Uh, Slateport, there we go. want to go to Slateport, which is the next town. Alright. Yeah, there is a lot of other stuff that we did pass, so we will eventually be going to those places as well. Um, oh, I didn't see the person under the umbrella, so now we have a double battle, which is alright. Uh, one Pokemon, so that's pretty cool. So we'll go ahead and uh, Pursuit, and we'll go ahead with Swift, so that kills off both, actually, which is pretty nice. Okay. So, now we can continue on. And there's a uh, Pokeball right here, which is a potion, so we'll need that for later. I don't know if this dude gives us anything. Uh, nope, he just talks to us. There's a dude here, but I'm not quite sure exactly what he, uh, um, what his point is for being there. Roxanne, let's see this. Roxanne of Rustbor City. Heard from Brawley that you're moving up through the ranks of trainers at an incredible clip. Well, I'd ra uh, rather not think that I can't beat you. I promise I will shape up my gym so that we may challenge us, or you may challenge us again. Alright. That's pretty cool. So Roxanne added us to her um So yeah. Now we can go ahead and move on through the uh the LP here and we have to talk to a specific person right in here. I don't know if it's this guy, I think it's this guy. The captain Yeah, I think it's that guy. I don't think there was anyone else. Yeah, there we go. So now they're all inside. Um, we'll go ahead and heal up just because we can, because, again, why not? Um, so, we will go ahead and go right inside here, and obviously we have to pay uh, 50, 50 cents or Poké Dollars just to get in. So now we'll go ahead and go up here, talk to the this dude right up here, and eventually we have to actually battle. So, we'll go ahead and take on the battles, because... What else is there great to do is of just battling? Just battling, you know. You gotta battle. battle and catch them all. So we're just seeing how far we can get today, which is alright. 
So I fight off these Team Aquas. The evil doers of Team Aqua don't stand a chance against us with legendary eats. Um, yeah, I did have uh, some codes, so if you guys are wondering how I got the legendaries, uh, if you haven't seen part one, I will post part one in the description below. And if you guys did not get a chance to see the uh, um, the unboxing of the Arceus pin, which is right here, pretty sweet. Um, if you guys want to see that, I'll post that in the description as well. Um, but I will get a chance to upload this one right here, and I did make a video of unboxing the Arceus. So I'll upload that as soon as I can. As um, So once we get as far in today's episode, um, we'll end it off, and I'll upload these as soon as possible. And we still have this weird guy named Scott that follows us. Again, if, uh, if you battle this guy, I don't know if you do, but if you do, then post in the comments below, because that would be interesting to, uh, to know. So if you guys do know if anyone has played through Emerald and knows if you battle this dude or not, just let me know in the comments below. That'd be helpful. Awesome. So let's see what this guy says. Huh. I'm sure I met you somewhere before. Have I introduced myself to you? Uh, if not, my name's Scat. I just saw Team Aqua run away from here like they were stung. Let me guess, you drove them away. Hmm. Maybe. Just maybe this trainer. Alright, I think you're good to... Uh, become a good friend, or good friend, maybe, uh, I don't know, that's what he said. Uh, so let's register each other in our Pokenavs. Alright, so they register in our Pokenav. Uh, what I'd like to do is tag along with you, but I want to keep an eye out, eye on the talents of other people too. So I'll be off to roam other towns a bit more, be seeing you Matrix. Alright. So I guess he's going to, uh, be, uh, Keeping a close eye on us, because I guess I don't know. Well, let's see if there's anything in the Pokenav about him. I'm not quite sure, but uh, let's see. Let's see. Oh, the Elvis eyes. What? The Lu lucid eyes. That's what it is. Interesting. So, anyways, we uh, have some. Oh, hey, if it isn't Matrix, let me guess. You're going to take. The battle tent challenge. Yeah, that's a good, that's a good idea. That is a really great idea. After all, a tough trainer is the perfect fit for the battle tent. Give it some effort. Huh. So that's something a little bit different in Emerald, where we have the battle tent. Um, so I think we'll go ahead and check that out later. And we have Professor Birch. Imagine seeing you here, and where might maybe. Oh, I see. You two are running separately. Well, that's fine. Oh, yes, I heard that your Pokenav had the match call system installed. Well, then I should register you in my Pokenav as well. That way, we, uh, even when we're apart, I can rate your Pokedex anytime. Alright, so that's pretty cool. So, he goes to where he goes, and we have a double battle right up here. So, not too bad. Um, so, we'll just go ahead and battle on. Battle on to be the very best like no one ever was. And we'll go ahead and just, you know, do some tactical moves. See what we can't battle here. Alright. And we are paralyzed, which is not necessarily great. And of course they have orange berries, so swift again. And we'll go with fire blast. Alright, so that's pretty good. We got them down. There we go. And one more, which is another minus. So we'll go ahead and do just that. And they are down. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay. So they registered us in the Pokenav. Uh, we'll go ahead and actually heal up quickly. And we should be able to get to the next town. We'll take on the gym, and I think we will end it there for now. Because we took on one gym, so let's go ahead and take on another gym. Just as easily. Um, so there are some trainers over here. Uh, we will actually come back for them later. Uh, so I will actually battle this one just because I um, got into a battle. So hopefully we should be able to finish this off and I will take off the paralysis or paralyze. However, people 
say it. I'm not quite sure. People usually say it differently, so that's okay. And we won this battle. So let's see if we have anything for... Yeah, there we go. We have one paralyzed heal. I think we also have some potions, but we'll get some um, other stuff later. Or berries to help with the paralyze. Um, so we'll go ahead and see if we can't get by this this dude. There we go. There are some other hidden items as well here, but I think we'll also come back for those as well. So we'll just go ahead and battle May, get to the gym, battle the gym, and we'll end off of that. So we have Psychic going on, gonna beat up May because we are amazing. And she finally has Grow File from level 15 all the way to 20. That's kind of crazy. Don't know how far she got that much, but interesting. Um, how she could have gotten from level 15 Trico to level 20 Grow File, but games are weird. Games are weird. So now we have the Iron Finder from May. And she rides away on her bike. And we'll go ahead and battle those dudes later. Because that is a double battle right there. Um, so we'll actually, you know what, we'll have to end up battling anyway. So we'll just go ahead and do this double battle right here. Because why not? We can't get past them. And there's only one, so that's nice. Uh, so we'll use Pursuit, and we'll use Swift. Alright, there we go. So pretty easily. Level 32 Deoxys. Nice. Alright. So that is done. We can go ahead and take the Elixir right here. And we can go ahead and move on. Uh, Alright. Alrighty guys, we are almost done with today's episode. Let's go ahead and grab these berries just because we can we grab these berries um, we'll go ahead and battle the, the gym let's actually get this item real quick which is an X speed so pretty cool um, I think we will get the bike later and I believe I believe we battle uh, Wally here yep we battle Wally because the uh, while he talks to his dad and while he wants to take on the gym and his dad says that he's not strong enough so which is pretty sad because we actually have to battle him and eventually like, well not eventually but obviously we'll have to end up winning against him because he thinks he's strong enough so he's going to end up training up his role so he can uh, battle gyms and then um, so yeah so that's pretty cool so now we are here and this dude comes back again as he watches us, which is kind of weird. So let's go ahead and take on this uh, this gym here. Um, so go ahead and we'll do just that. Um, so I think we have to at least battle this one dude, which is fine. So I think he doesn't... Yeah, he's got a Zigzagoon and one other, one other Pokemon up his sleeve. Um, so what is it? Oh, Gulpin. So we'll go ahead and use Psychic. Super effective. Pretty good. All right. So now that we've done that, we can go ahead and right here. There we go. So battle just one trainer. And I'll go ahead and battle the gym leader right here. And we'll end off today with that. So we'll go ahead and use Psychic. He's got four Pokemon. So I think we should be able to win with Psychic. Let's go ahead and see Magneton. We'll use Psychic. Oh, okay, so that didn't really do much. We'll go with Psychic again. And one last Pokemon. And let's go with Pursuit. Okay, so again, that didn't really do too much. Let's go with Psychic if we can. Um, let's try Psychic if we can again. There we go. Alright, critical hit. So that's pretty cool. So we beat off the Gym Leader. Then we got the Dynamo Badge. Awesome. 
And we got TM34, which is Shockwave. And we registered in the Pokenav Watson, so that's pretty cool. We beat off the gym leader. So now we have a total of three badges, actually. So by the next episode, we should have a fourth badge, and if possible, the next badge. So we will actually go ahead and heal up. Let's go ahead and get our bike, and we'll end off there at a high note, because this was pretty good. Um, so we'll go ahead and get our bike right here, talk to this dude. Um, yes, we would like a bike. And we get to choose between which bikes. So, he tells us the bikes, we'll go with the acro bike for now. And what's a bummer is that we can't get both bikes, but in Auras you can get both bikes, which is interesting. So, pretty interesting stuff today. Uh, we did do a lot. So we'll go ahead and save right here. We'll end off. This was pretty fun. Hope you guys did enjoy this episode. We did a lot of stuff. Uh, we will be going back to do other things that we bypassed. Um, so yeah, if you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to smash that like button. Subscribe if you are new. Make sure to drop a comment below if you did enjoy it. Um, if we can get at least 100 or 200 likes on my future videos and these LPs of Rebooted Emerald, so we will do a giveaway as soon as I see that, which is pretty awesome, because you guys are just amazing with 90 and above subscribers, that is awesome. Thank you guys so much, and again, I'll see you guys in the next one, and as always, welcome to the Matrix.